Since 1896, the University of Michigan has won more than 352 Big Ten championships. In 1989, a new Michigan team was formed. This team doesn't compete in a stadium or arena, but they've been stockpiling national titles at an unprecedented rate. The Michigan team, we believe, is America's best. The Michigan Solar Car Team has become a symbol of excellence in Ann Arbor and around the world. Every two years, team members build a new car to compete in the American Solar Car Challenge and World Solar Challenge. Since 1990, the team has won an unprecedented seven championships in the United States and five times has finished in the top three in the World Championships. This isn't just a classroom project. This is a real project where it takes two years to complete. We build a real car that goes on the open public roads and completely run by students, we race this million dollar car against the world's best teams. The legacy is a really big part of this team and the fact that we can come to this school and beat them all and be the best in this country and very competitive in the world, it's really a nice sense of accomplishment. With over 100 participants, the Solar Team is the largest student project on campus, and the organization's four divisions are comprised solely of students. I love the fact that students from all over the university become part of this team. So the students are not all engineers. I think what it shows is that there are top flight programs across the university. The solar car works in actually a pretty simple way. No engines, no carburetors. You have the solar cells on top that generate electricity from the sun and they can charge the batteries and in turn the batteries will power the motor. We actually make the car in two bodies essentially, but each body is one piece of carbon fiber. So that just means that we can lift the car into two halves and it'll be easier to essentially maintain parts of the car. After the car is assembled, the only element left to operate the vehicle is the sun hitting the 500 solar cells on the frame. In 2012, behind their state-of-the-art vehicle, Quantum, the Michigan team reached a new level of dominance by winning their fourth straight national title by a record-setting 10 hours and 18 minutes. In the end, racing, it doesn't matter who you're competing against. It's just about improving yourself, showing the world what you can do. The Michigan Solar Car Team boasts over 100 sponsors, all of whom keep tabs on the project but a neighbor keeps the closest watch. Because of the Michigan solar car team, Ford will be a better competitor in the marketplace because we're learning a lot, interacting with a great set of individuals, and will help us make ourselves more competitive, more successful going forward. This is preparing kids for the future. I mean, you can take your classes and you can do the theory and you can solve your math homework or you can go out and really apply it. And that's what the business world is about. That's what the real world is about. You can't really learn this type of material in a classroom and getting to be able to, at such a young age, kind of put it into action and try out these things is a really invaluable experience. And I think we're very lucky to be at a university that supports this kind of program.